All right, so the scorpion. You might have heard of it. What the heck is the scorpion? How do you do it? Why do you do it? When do you do it? Who do you do it to? I think that's all, that's all the questions. Scorpion. Get so traditionally, the place that's toughest for players to defend is right in this little area, the, the right armpit, right? You get them caught in that chicken wing position. However, if we are able to get below that position, if we're able to position our body below where our chicken wing is, it's no longer an issue, right? Now that I'm standing below the level of the net, my opponents could never chicken wing me, right? So the scorpion is a shot where you almost have to guess a little bit that your opponent is going to speed the ball up and they're going to speed the ball up through you. They're not gonna be going to, to one side or the other. If they go to one side or the other while I'm like this, I'm toast. Thank you to Super Coffee for sponsoring this video. I drink Super Coffee every morning and that's why my eyes look like this. I'm pumped up. Super Coffee is a healthy way to start your morning, right? You have to read this shot correctly. But what you do is you drop down a little bit low and you get that paddle basically right up in front of you. From this position, you punch outwards. And it has the added benefit of nobody knows where this thing is going. <laughs> it could go basically anywhere. So when I see my opponent lining up for a low attack, that's when I'll generally get into this position. So my opponent will be attacking and I need to understand the angles that they can create. If my opponent is directly in front of me, I can cover a decent amount of his or her angle from this shot. However, if my opponent is lined up to the side of me, well then, now my opponent can hit it off to the side or off to this side, and the scorpion isn't an appro appropriate shot. So to execute the scorpion, obviously we, we get down, and the tendency when we first hit this shot, whenever I get a ball and I'm standing like this at the kitchen line, I'm generally punching downwards. But when we scorpion, we really need to be punching outwards. If I hit downwards, I'm going right into the net. If I hit outwards, boom, got him. <laughs> so that's what the scorpion is. How to execute it is, is difficult. You can work on it just by having somebody feed you a decent amount of, of balls and just work on punching outwards. Yeah, gotcha. Scorpioned. I think it's called the scorpion because if you really get into that position early and you're like this, you kind of look like a scorpion with their, with their tail up. That's my best guess. So anyway, the scorpion is one of those shots that you might have heard of. You might have been wondering, what the heck is it? Is it right for me? Almost certainly not, but there's an explanation for you. Tag your friends. So yeah, just attack one from below the level of the net on, let's say, your third shot. All right, that's too ridiculous. Murray, get out of here, dude. That was, <laughs> that was too ridiculous. But it was good. One. <laughs> All right, yeah. get out of here. I can do this. I'm, I'm focused. I'm One, focused. two, three. Nice, came back. Good stuff. Good hands. So that worked. My scorpion worked there because we were lined up directly in front of each other. I knew that he was making contact below the level of the, the net, so his shot had to go up. He goes up, I go down, and I get into that position. He didn't have angles to hit the ball away from me. Now we're gonna show the wrong way, where if I've pulled Matt off to one side or the other, and he has angles to attack me down the line or attack me down the center, this is not a way, effective way of defending okay so we'll show here one two two attack the next one three see now if he has angles i can't cover all the way off to one side or the other we'll try it one more time that was a perfect attack there's one there's two there's 
There's three. Oh no. All right, we'll just go. We'll just go two. <laughs> I suppose we don't need three. There's one. There's two. Oh, it worked. Damn it. It wasn't supposed to work. There's one. There's two. Ah. But he had me. If you liked today's video, please feel free to share it with a friend and make sure to subscribe. It helps me out and helps me grow my channel.